Thanks for joining me for this video tutorial of Servoy's SVY Search module. This module is easy to use and will help you to deliver Google-like text searches against your own data model. Simply use the API to map the relations and columns from your database that you want to make searchable, then pass in the raw user input. The SVY Search module will do the heavy lifting like parsing text and generating queries. Let's take a closer look. Here I have a simple example solution, which is showing a list detail split view of sales order records from my database. I have a text box that will capture user input and run the search. Let's try it out. Typing Germany, you can see that quickly I find all orders that were shipped to Germany. But this still leaves a lot of records. Let's narrow our search down by adding another word, coffee. Quickly, I get all results for orders which were shipped to Germany, but also have coffee in the shipment. Finally, I enter Janet, and quickly my results are narrowed down to just those orders sold by sales rep Janet Leverling. You may have noticed that the user doesn't need to know the names of the database columns. They can simply enter the values that they are interested in finding. Let's take a closer look at how it works. Inside my Servoy IDE, I highlight the search box and navigate to the event handler. Inside the code editor, you can see that I've called the SVY Search API and created an instance of the Simple Search class. I've passed it this forms found set to specify the data source. And I pass it the raw user input, which will be parsed. Next, I specify the data providers that I want to have searched. These can just be the names of columns in the table but I also can specify foreign columns in any relations I may have created, such as the customer or sales rep name. You can see that quite easily I can search across many relations. By this approach, I was able to show orders which contain the word coffee in any of the line items products. Pretty simple so far. Let's switch back to the browser and try out some other features. So far, we have searched only on text fields in my order and related tables, but the SVY Search API applies to other data types, including dates and numbers. Let's say that I'm interested in finding orders with coffee from 1997 and later. I can enter the alias for the order date column, followed by a value expression. There are two things to notice here. First, I have explicitly specified that I'm interested in the order date because I have entered it with the alias ordered, followed by a colon and then the value expression. Second, I have used a greater than operator to indicate that I want any matching records after the specified date. By modifying the search criteria to use the between operator, I can specify an upper and lower bound to my search, limiting it to orders only from the year 1997. This approach works well for numeric fields too. I will narrow my search down further by entering the criterion for freight, which is greater than $100. There are other operators and you can use them in any combination. For example, let's say that I'm interested in orders containing coffee, which were shipped to Germany, but I want to omit records from my search that match certain conditions. Here, I use the minus operator, and now I'm able to easily omit the quick stop customer, for example, or the sales rep, Andrew. There are, of course, more operators and additional features like case sensitivity and dynamic substitution mapping. But I hope what I've shown you is compelling and demonstrates how easy it is to get started. For more information, please visit the project site. There is comprehensive wiki documentation and you can download the module and this example solution. Thank you.